hello everyone uh, welcome back to the AMS tutorial uh, today we will learn that how we can uh, we can get our results from the AMS uh, simulation which is uh, about the perovskite sources in the specific uh, condition or under some conditions and how we can make a visualize in origin uh, origin pro let's say we have our M amps uh, interface then we need to check the ambient condition then we click ok then we need to upload our device which we have previously uh, added so we need to click load and the name of that device was uh, first layer then we need to open then we need to check it that is uh, the ETL titania or sky layer and spiral and then we have to click ok and run the simulation yes and need to wait for a few minutes then check it this is the JV curve of our device let's move it uh, uh, from here to the origin pro so I need to click copy and then open the origin pro from your laptop or from your source and here we need just to copy it this column if we can see so there are two columns one is about the voltage and the other is about the current density so here we we can say this is the VOC which is the open circuit voltage and the unit uh, would be volt volt and this is the current density or the short short circuit current density so we can we can call it JSC and the unit would be milliampere divided by centimeter square so now select these two columns and just draw the graph so here we can see along x-axis we have the open circuit voltage along y-axis we have the short current density and then we can play around and make it uh, more visual so we can say that uh, for example if I want to let's say I want to make it more visual so for example in black color so this is the symbol and this is the line which we can make bold for example 5 for the for the sake of the manuscript and let's say apply it and for example if we want to change the legend so we can change it that is the JV or JV curve and we can play around this one let's say make it bold so this is the JV then we can make the y axis more realistic so we can go to the scale from 0 to for example 28 milliampere per centimeter square and let's see the value of the gap value is 4 so we can apply it the horizontal will start from 0 to let's say 1.2 and the gap uh, we would like to keep it 0 0.2 apply it then uh, go to the line and text make it bold let's say this is like 4 and n the minor and major uh, text we want it uh, want it inside so let's say in the top there is you know, we can want it for the thickness and none none okay apply it and now on the left we keep it for thickness 
and we want in in and apply it similarly on the right side we want to include just the uh, line this is like so you keep the none or here okay then okay for example if you want to make it bold so let's make it bold in 22 so it will be more visual bold it and 22 make it uh, like for example if you want to make it more realistic so this is j uh, jsc for speed let's say keep the thickness bold and let's say 26 and this is the j jc short circuit current density the unit is milli ampere into centimeter minus 2 or square okay this is jc line or the x-axis would, would be uh, open circuit voltage let's say this is uh, voc okay so this is voc and the unit is volt so from here you can you can play around and you can make it more clear visual and you can put this figure in your uh, manuscript or in your paper in coming videos we will learn that how we can make other uh, parameters in the origin and you can also move this figure to the ppt like for example send to the ppt so you can say okay now from here you can you can save it as a jpg or tiff file and so on so in the coming tutorial we will learn further uh, parameters how we can simulate and how we can build these results so please if you have any question uh, let me know in the comment box and please share subscribe and likes thank you so much